Hey, this is Frank from Max Digital, and I want to shoot you over this quick video with some specific things that you guys can do yourselves just to help bring in more business, just utilizing your website and your Google Business Profile a little bit more. So I did a search on Plumber in Fort Lauderdale because I saw you service that area. And so here are the results page uh, or results that come up. So since 90% of the people never click past the first page, you're going to want to take up as much of the real estate on this page as possible. And there's three sections to the page. So if you're not going to pay Google to advertise uh, you're, and get into this first section, you're really going to want to focus on getting into the second and third section. So the second section here is known as the Google Map Pack. And to get into this section, which consists of the three businesses with the strongest Google profile, one thing you're going to want to do is make sure that you're listed in more online directories than these three guys here are. Uh, so there's thousands of directories online that you can join. Uh, Yelp.com, Angie's List, just to name a couple. And many of them are free to join. It just takes time to go out there and enter in your business name, address, and phone number in each of those web pages uh, exactly the way you have it set up here with Google. Google is a popularity contest. so. Uh, they're going to want to see who are the prominent plumbers in the Fort Lauderdale area, and they do that based on who's mentioned the most online across the internet. So that's how you get into this uh, area here. Second thing, uh, second thing I want to talk about here is the organic listings. So getting into the organic listings is based on the strength of your content and your backlinks profile. So I want to talk about, uh, show you here at Fort Lauderdale Plumber. This is the number one ranked plumbing site in Fort Lauderdale. And so I want to compare your content and backlinks profile to Fort Lauderdale Plumbers. All right, so going over to your site here, I see here uh, that you got some pretty good content on here. Uh, one thing you should know about Google is that they look for 1,500 to 2,000 words on the home page for you to be optimized with them and be considered an authoritative site or an expert in the niche. So I could see uh, you're a little short of that. I think you have about 500 words on here uh, or 600 words. So you know, that one recommendation would be to add more words to your home page here. And then you don't want to just add any words. You want to make sure that your content is dense in local buyer intent keywords. So keyword phrases are the phrases that you want your business to be found for online. And local buyer intent keyword phrases are keyword phrases that uh, contain both the service you provide and the location you provide it in. So I use this tool here called Arifs uh, to analyze different websites. So this is your website here. And I can see that you are currently ranking for 1,300 keywords. So when I click into it, it'll tell me exactly what keyword phrases you're you're ranking for. And so I want to see here. Now these are local buyer intent keyword phrases, which is great. You can see um, Pembroke Pines, Hollywood, Florida, Miami Beach, all all good local buyer intent keyword phrases. And as a result, you are ranking in the top 10 for each of these. Uh, for each of these keyword phrases and you can see there's a lot of volume coming in on each of these this is the number of searches per month so I want to show you how you can uh, get to that top spot in the in the organic ranking so I'm going to go back here and look at uh, your also oops. It's ranking for 203 keywords to see his for a lot of plumber and he's got his uh, his keyword phrases set up um, um, because he is the Fort Lauderdale plumber, I guess. He's focused he heavily on Fort Lauderdale. Obviously, you're servicing multiple areas. Uh, one thing you can do to get to the, uh, to the top of the organic pages is to create a locations page. So you have a loca separate location page for each area that you service. And then by doing that, you can focus the content on each of those pages. Uh, towards the city that you are looking to service uh, and then that would cause you to rank uh, or to be able to rank high for the uh, for the keyword phrase local buyer intent keyword phrases for that area so um, so beefing up your content maybe creating different location pages uh, so that you can build into this uh, into that content the local buyer intent keyword phrases is definitely going to help so then the next thing I wanted to mention was uh, your backlinks uh, profile. So backlinks are just links from other websites over to your website and they uh, act as an endorsement of your site and so provide therefore provide legitimacy in Google's, Google's eyes. So again with Google being a popularity contest you want to have more backlinks than your competitor has. You also want backlinks to be quality backlinks meaning that they're coming from other trusted sites and you can tell that because every website has a 
a, uh, a UR score, which is a strength score, and a DR score, which is a trust score with Google. And a good website will be uh, with a DR score of, uh, in the 30 to 40 range. And you do want these numbers to be as close to a one-to-one -one relationship as possible. So now going back over to your competitor, uh, he has 246 backlinks from 41 referring domains, and you have more backlinks uh, from 621 referring domains. So more referring domains, more backlinks. Uh, you just have to look at the quality of the backlinks that you're getting. Uh, he does have a higher DR score, which means he may be getting higher backlinks or higher quality backlinks than you are. Uh, so you could, what you can do is click on his referring domains and you can see exactly what sites he's linked to and go out and try to get the same uh, links that are, that are scored highly uh, with the DR score here. Uh, so that, that's what I would recommend if you wanted to rank high in the different locations that you uh, service. You, again, just set up a location page, and I think that will make it a lot easier for you to uh, build in the right keyword phrases uh, so that you can uh, beat out these competitors in these different locations. Uh, if you have any questions, please reach out or respond to my email. My contact information is in there. Uh, if, if you wouldn't mind just responding with uh, one line just to let me know if this was helpful or not, uh, that would be greatly appreciated. Thank you.